up guys Phoenix here and welcome to uh, part three or four I've lost count of every tutorial I've been doing so far I think this is three or four of the Airy Chan from My Hero Academia we're gonna be doing the hair today um, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna stick to my 15 minute limit again so I want to just jump right into this thing and make sure we get this hair all around and to the other side so we have quite a bit ways to go so let's go to the left side where we have this piece of dirt marking off this uh, I want to say very very tall extension right here <laughs> and we're gonna put a dirt block on top and we're gonna be going up into the right for this segment so I just want you to put your placement block to the top or right side each time and you should be fine okay every time I tell you to put something just make sure there's a grass block on the top or right at the end and you're good to go so let's go up into the right four vertical one two three four place from block up into the right three vertical one two three and although the frame of her head is kind of small, this has to go all the way around it and give it enough room for detail inside. So this is going to be a pretty, pretty wide arc. And it's going to end on the right side where you see the dirt on the floor on the right-hand camera screen. Um, we're going to reach all the way over there. So from here, we're going to go up into the right. Five vertical, two times in a row. One, two, three, four, five. Placement block. One, two, three, four, five. And I mean, the bigger numbers like this kind of help speed it up because it makes the gap smaller. But from here, we're going to go up into the right three vertical. One, two, three. Place one block. Up into the right five vertical again. One, two, three, four, five. Up into the right three vertical. One, two, three. Up into the right two vertical two times in a row. One, two, that's one. One, two, that's two. Up into the right six singles. One, two three four five six up into the right two vertical one two up into the right one single up into the right two vertical two times in a row one two that's one one two that's two up into the right one single and we're almost to the point where we're gonna start flattening things out so that's gonna be pretty fun to do because to be honest, I hate when the numbers are really small like this. So from here, we're gonna go up into the right three vertical now. So one, two, three, whoops, three, place one block on top. Up into the right one single again. Up into the right two vertical, two times in a row. One, two, that's one. Place one block on top or right side. One, two, that's two. Up into the right seven singles. One, two three four five six seven up into the right two flat one two up into the right three singles now one two three and i saw a comment earlier somebody was saying that they don't actually use the placement blocks anymore um, the placement blocks are mainly for new users. If you've been to a bunch of pixel arts already, you probably are just placing them like this and you know where to go. Um, but for safety precautions, the placement blocks are helpful. You, you can't mess it up. So anyways, from here, we're going to go up into the right two flat. One, two. I guess I was just happy to see that some people are becoming experts. Um, since I've been getting new comments from new users over the course of the anime uh, series. And I appreciate all the anime fans turning up in the comments for me. Um, showing support on the bills and stuff. I love it. Anyways, from here, we're going to go up into the right two singles. One, two. Up into the right two flat. One, two. Up into the right two singles again. One, two. Up into the right two flat. One, two. And let me just zoom out and just make sure I didn't accidentally repeat myself too many times. So we had after the seven singles, was it? After the seven singles, we had two flat, right here. Then we had three singles. Yep, one, two, three. Then we had two flat again. And then we should add single, single, two, single, single, two. So single, single, two flat, single, single, two flat. Perfect. All right. This is when everything's repeat like that. I, my brain gets mushy sometimes, and I don't want to mess that up. So anyways, from here, we're almost at the top. We're going to go up into the right four flat. One, two, three, four. Up into the right three flat. One, two, three. Placement block. Up into the right two flat. 
one, two, play some blocks. Up and to the right, 11 flat, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. If you notice, we're hovering over the center point right here, so this is where it's gonna dip and go back down to the bottom. Um, it didn't take too long to reach that point. The numbers were pretty big to work with, but let's, there is some detail in the hair right here that you probably don't wanna miss. So let's put our placing block on the bottom this time, and we're gonna go down into the right two flat, one, two, and from the right block in that two flat, we're gonna do a few things. First, we're gonna put one block underneath it to create this backwards R shape. Then we're going to mark the top block right here and come back to it later, but from the bottom block we just put underneath, we're gonna go down into the right, three singles, one, two, three, and then down into the right five verticals. So place block underneath or to the right side. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Now let's backtrack back to the top block right here. And I want to go up into the right nine flat. So let's put a place block to the top block. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Down into the right two flat. So place some block underneath or to the right side. One, two. And from the two flat, we're gonna go to the left block and kind of do what we did over here. We're gonna put one underneath. And then we're gonna go down to the left one single. Down its left two vertical, one, two. Down its left one single again. And then down its left three vertical. One, oops, one, two, three. Perfect. Now there are still some, still some lines to do in the hair, but we'll get to that in a minute. Um, there's actually a lot of lines to do in the hair. But I just wanna make sure that this reaches the other side. So we're gonna go back up to the two flat we had right here. And we're gonna go up and to the right, four flat. One, two, three, four. Down and to the right, four flat. One, two, three, four. Down and to the right, two flat again. One, two. Down and to the right, seven flat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And from the seven flat, we're gonna mark the first block and the last block on the right side. From the first block, we can leave the marker there and come back to it later. But from the last block, we're gonna put a placing block underneath it and go down into the right two flat and start the downward curve towards the other coal spot over there. From that two flat, we're gonna go to the right block and go down into the right one single. Down into the right two flat again. One, two. <clears throat> oh my God, my voice is cracking. Down and to the right two singles, one, two. Down and to the right two flat, one, two. Down and to the right six singles, one, two, three, four, five, six. And then from there, we're gonna go down and to the right two vertical, and this is where we're gonna kind of split off. Um, we can either go to the bottom right of it and continue building to the ground, which I kind of wanted to do, or we can, um, build the branch up and to the left. So what I'm gonna do is on the bottom block right here, we're gonna put one coal to the left. We're also gonna go up and to the left one single. Up and to the left two flat, <clears throat> one, two. Up to the left one single again. Up and to the left two flat, one, two. Up and to the left two singles, one, two. Up and to the left two flat, one, two, and then finally up into left two singles. One, two. So I know that was very confusing and I've kind of rushed through it. Let me just zoom out so you can see what it's supposed to look like. And then let's go to the bottom right and continue building down. So let's put our placement block underneath right here. And we're gonna go down into the right from here, two vertical, one, two. And actually from the two vertical, we can actually put an extra block to the left of that top block right there, just to kind of thicken up the line. So if you need a remap of what we just did, I went to the bottom right here, went down to the right to two vertical, and we went to the top block and the two vertical and just added one to the left. Anyways, from there, we're gonna go down into the right one single, down into the right two vertical again, one, two, down into the right four singles, one, two, three, four. And we're just constantly putting our placement block at the bottom each time just because it's uh, 
it's the same direction it's going in. It's not going to really change up much. I think we're almost level with the point that we're supposed to be going down at, so it should be a lot of big numbers coming up. Anyways, from here, we're going to go down into right 2 vertical. 1, 2. Down into right 5 singles. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Down into right 2 vertical two times in a row. 1, 2, that's 1. 1, 2, that's 2. Down into right 1 single. Down into right 2 vertical again. 1, 2. Down into the right 4 vertical. 1, 2, 3, 4. Place one block underneath. And like I said, the numbers are going to start getting really, really big now. So just kind of pay attention. Um, you're going to have to just pay attention to your counting. It's not really hard to mess up. So we're going to go down into the right 5 vertical. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Down into the right 12 vertical. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Down into right 11 vertical. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Whoops. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Oh my god, why can't I count? That's annoying. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Okay, and then we go back up. Get rid of this dirt block. And then we can just keep on bridging down. So, let's set a place and block underneath this 11 vertical now. And we're going to go down into the right 8 vertical. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Down into the right 5 vertical. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Down into the right 8 vertical. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And from the 8 vertical, we can split off kind of like what we did at the top over there. Oh, we can't even see at the top where we split off. Um, kind of like what we did at the top. So at the bottom of the 8 vertical, we're going to count up 4 blocks. 1, 2, 3, 4. And we're going to put 1 coal to the left right there. From that 1 to the left, we're going to go up into the left 3 vertical. 1, 2, 3. Up into the left 5 vertical. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Up into the left three vertical, or oh wait, two vertical, sorry. One, two. And then we can trace this all the way back down to where we started with the eight vertical right here and go to the bottom of it. So we're on the home stretch right now from the bottom of it. All we're going to do is it's a bunch of smaller numbers until we reach the bottom. So we're going to go down into the right three vertical. One, two, three. Place one block underneath. Down into the right two vertical two times in a row. 1, 2, that's 1. 1, 2, that's 2. Down into right 3 vertical again. 1, 2, 3. Down into right 2 vertical. We're actually going to do this 4 times in a row, so count carefully. 1, 2, that's 1. Place one block underneath or to the right side. 1, 2, that's 2. 1, 2, that's 3. And 1, 2, that's 4. Now let's just clean up this workspace right here. Perfect. From there, we're going to go down into the right. Actually, we're supposed to go down into the right a lot more. Let me see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So we're going to do it again another four more. So we already have the four right here. We're going to go down into the right two vertical four more times. So 1, 2, that's 5. 1, 2, that's 6. 1, 2, that's 7. And 1, 2, that's 8. So going back and counting it out now, it should be eight of them in a row. So make sure you count that carefully. Um, that was my bad. I, I made bad notes for myself. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, perfect. From here, we're going to go down into the right one single. So place one block underneath or to the right side. One. Down into the right two vertical, four times in a row. One, two, that's one. One, two, that's two. One, two, that's three. And finally, one, two, that's four. And then the home stretch. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. No, no, no. That's not the block that we're supposed to work with. For the home stretch, we're going to go down into the right four vertical two times in a row. One, two, three, four. That's one. One, two, three, four. That's two. And then down into the right 30 vertical, which technically should just drag it to the ground. Hopefully, it meets up with that block we have waiting for it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and the 10th block's already there, so that's perfect. So that means we fully completed the frame of Airy, which means we can go into detail now and do the inner lining of the hair and the inner lining of the eyes and stuff. So I think in the next part we will do the face and then worry about the hair last, or we will do the hair and then the face last. But uh, we're making good progress. So hopefully you guys are enjoying the tutorial. If you are, be sure to like and subscribe for more pixel art content. This is Phoenix, and as always, I'll see you guys later.